Hey guys, so right here you see this is the front of my cabin and it's made out of, well supposed to be the outside is like a brick brick wall which I printed these paper out these papers out from Google so yeah later on in the video I'll show you the inside of the cabin okay guys so this is the inside of the cabin and I'm actually working on some photos that I like to put up on the walls so I went to Google and I printed a few photos out I put it on some paper board so that it's pretty sturdy and just not too cheesy if that makes sense you know something that'll be strong because I like to place these on the wall and of course I would like to frame them so I cut up I found this photo of the horses I found this photo I love it and I also found this photo it's a photo of a room inside of a cabin so I thought that that would add some nice touches to the room I'm working on the cabin windows what's up everybody this is dolls will be dolls and as you can see I got all these printed out uh, backdrops of a forest because remember I am doing uh, a Christmas episode so I'm still preparing and building stuff for the scenes that I want to create. So yep, yeah, so I just took some poster board and taped them together. See the tape? I taped them all together and I'm creating a scene. So where I'm just gonna glue these papers onto the board. Of course, I'm gonna cut this white trim off. I don't want that to show. And it's gonna give me some nice uh, foresty scenes, okay? Bye. I love this corner so guys moving along you can see here you can see where I got I have the fireplace and I have the fire burning I think that is so epic I love this so much um, and I'm just going around showing you the other little furniture and other details that's in here look at this window I need to put a window scene in there uh, check out some of the photos that's on the wall that I printed out and I made like a wood type of frame around it Here's another little chair or couch that my daughter made Love it Crafty J. I made the middle couch. Can you believe it? Crafty J. she made this beautiful yellow and white couch I decided to put it in this room because I just thought Why not add some color to this nice like golden tan a type of wood a paper that's on the walls as you can see I got like a green uh, crop my sister crocheted that for me so what you see here is I'm just kind of like going around the room and I'm showing you some of the details that's in the room finally I got some furniture so I think it looks really nice um, I was kind of going red crazy but my daughter said no not too much red so why not put the yellow couch in there I thought that it would just add a little more color so as you can see you know I'm just showing you these in photos and it's been fun with this I'm really enjoying it as you can see the green carpet my sister made it for me um, so I'm just having fun because I can't wait to bring a real nice Christmas story for you guys so as you guys can see I'm still just going around showing you the cabin and the photos that's on the wall I really love it it's really bringing it together of course I need some other details I love this photo so pretty um need other details in there like I'd like to get a table look at these champagnes um bottles my daughter bought these for me these are so cute um, and I really love how she made this fireplace. I mean that is like the baddest part of the cabin Okay, so Here I am. I'm recording on my phone and this is what this room is looking like right now guys um, I'm definitely gonna need some end tables because it's still pretty empty well, I won't say it's pretty empty, but you know, I can't wait. This is going to be a Christmas episode, so I can't wait to finish decorating this. I can't wait. I'm super excited. So, 
And I can't believe that I made this this red and white couch. Finally, I made a couch that looks like a couch. And yep, here we go. So please just stay tuned. This is just um, me showing you what um, progress I made with this. So yep, so maybe by the time I come back, um, this will be completed. Thank you for being so patient, guys. Thank you so much.